Hi everyone, welcome back. Once again, I'm taking you for a walk with me outside and uh, today I would like to um, share another important reason why uh, Ukrainian ladies get cold with you or act not interested, especially if at first they showed interest and they showed a uh, desire to be in touch with you but you feel that they are becoming cold or not as responsive uh, once again uh, we have an initial interest before so i've already mentioned two, two other reasons uh, in my previous video we talked about um, Sometimes somebody just not into you, and sometimes uh, women do not feel enough of leadership from your side. But there is another major reason, um, and I think it's especially um, developing right now with the time of technology, and I will tell you what it is. A lot of times, uh, people do not have enough going on in their life and they are looking for a partner and so when they find that partner they even more focusing on that they are not focusing on their interests on their career uh, on their own life at the moment they give full attention to the other person uh, to the point where they neglect sleep they neglect um, their their career pursuits, they neglect social life, and basically when this happens, you focus completely on a lady, she starts to lose interest because uh, things are becoming very predictable, you are always in Facebook Messenger, you are always uh, on the phone, you try to text a lot, and subconsciously the lady feels that um, you are, it's becoming very, very predictable and very, very boring um, in a way that they feel uh, suffocated and they feel that it's the same thing every single day. You know, every morning there is a, let's say like every morning there is a message Good morning, how are you, what are you doing, where are you going, and it's a lot of small talk, it's a lot of, um, it's a lot of conversations that don't have depths, don't necessarily bring value or interest. It's basically, the, the third reason why they're becoming cold is basically they feel bored with you. And some of you will say right now, well, you know, so when you give attention to her, it's bad. When you don't give attention to the lady, it's also bad. But to explain this to you the best way, I can uh, have a, the opposite example. Imagine that you met a girl that is the most beautiful girl you've ever seen. She's, she's very attractive. She's everything you ever wanted. You like her personality. She's just... She's just you dream and you met her you were lucky to meet her all right and everything is going great you're having a great time but from some point she starts to be so much into you that she's blowing your phone she's texting you non-stop uh she is you are her main focus in in everything she's also jealous and worried she's insecure about what you're doing so basically she doesn't give you she does not give you any space you always feel that uh you have to keep you updated uh she doesn't really share any new experiences with you anything that she's doing so basically she's just chasing you as if you would not be interested in her yourself she's starting to um take all of your time and you just looking for an escape and you just lose interest because it's always the same thing. So when it comes to international relationships, and we talk today about Ukrainian ladies and Western men, one of the things is, guys, respect the person's boundaries. If she doesn't respond to messages or 
you know, uh, give your, you gotta give her some space, you know, you have to understand that uh, she might do something that does not include you, and it's okay, you know, we all want to share about our day, but some people do not know how to deliver a story, you know, how to make a joke. Some of the guys, I feel like, especially the IT kind of guys, they would just go like, yes, I, I went there, I went here, I went home, I was tired, I went to sleep, I drink coffee. So you have to uh, also sometimes try to look at yourself from a different perspective and see if your conversations can be a bit inspiring, interesting. Yes, sometimes they're gonna be sad. Sometimes you're gonna, you're gonna, you want some support. But make sure that you are not a monotone, boring person that doesn't have any interests. And you always count on your lady, on your new lady especially, to fulfill that void of time. Um, try to make sure that each time you connect, you have something interesting to share you know you even if it was a boring day you know you can joke about it you can have an engaging conversation um, because number three major reason is boredom and if you have free time we had talked about this before pick up a book get an audio book learn a little bit about russian ukrainian culture about history about something interesting you can connect and talk I feel that the problem, the problem with, for example, U.S. is that people do not know much of history, much of geography, much of literature, on average. Of course, there are a lot of educated people, there are people who have interests, there are people who are traveled, experienced things, but a lot of people have so much, so little knowledge about things and... Uh, so unsophisticated, if I can tell, that the lady feels like she's just losing interest because you you can't support an interesting conversation. And being able to surprise your lady with something, you know, uh, do something different, you know, instead of a long, boring uh, text, send you a short video of you made just for her, you know, uh, send her a card, something, you know, do something that, you know, you will always have a little bit of a surprise and not a monotone, while respecting her space. I feel that with technology, a lot of people do no longer respect your space, they think that they are entitled to your time, and that is very disappointing. She might have you know, tea or coffee with your friends, she might be at a family dinner, and you might think, oh, she's ignoring me, she doesn't care. You have to have that um, confidence in yourself where you don't count on the other person completely uh, fulfill your days. When you give somebody space, people try to reach out to you, they're looking forward to talk to you, um, Try to have that, you know, variety in your conversation, you know, not just, you know, one thing, how are you? Russian and Ukrainians are not that big on small talk. Make your conversations interesting and um, give people space, give your lady space, uh, give your friend space. Maybe she'll become your lady, you know? Don't think that just because somebody have a Facebook messenger, uh, they have all the time in the world to, to, to chat with you, you know. Uh, call, call them over text. Have sometimes FaceTime. Uh, doesn't have to be long, you know. Give them that feeling that you care, but don't be needy. Because both men and women do not like that, especially when it's becoming boring and monotone. So guys, and with that being said, I want to show you this incredible beauty while I'm here before I go. It's a beautiful Ferris wheel on Padol. It's very, very nice, beautiful architecture around it. But, you gotta see it yourself. So instead of hundreds, 
conversations and discussions, take an action, come and see her.